Hey guys, I think we got a real treat for you today. Thanksgiving's over, the holidays are in full swing. We're going to have our church Christmas dinner this Saturday. I'm going to smoke two turkey breasts. And today what I'm going to show you is how to make an apple cider brine to soak your turkey breast in before you either smoke it or cook it in the oven. It just gives it a, a little different and very good flavor. Here's how you do this. So our recipe calls for apple cider. It calls for black pepper corns, but we're going to use black pepper. It calls for rosemary, but instead of rosemary, we're going to use uh, some garlic and an onion. It calls for thyme, kosher salt, and sage. So we're gonna start out with a half a gallon of water. And I don't know what kind of apples you like, but I love Honeycrisp apples. And I found this apple cider made from Honeycrisp apples. And we're going to pour the whole thing in here, minus what I'm probably gonna taste, just to see what it tastes like. Oh my goodness, it smells good. That is so good. And I'm gonna go ahead and turn the heat up on high. While the water and the cider are heating up, I'm going to take an onion, a couple cloves of garlic, and I'm just gonna cut them in half. And I'm gonna cut them in half long ways like this As a matter of fact i'm going to quarter the onion just so i can get plenty of juice out of it i'm not going to worry about skinning the onion i'm not going to worry about any of the uh, roots or anything because they're not going to actually be in the turkey. They're just going to be in the brine. Okay, so I have an elephant garlic, large cloves. I'm just going to drop those in there just like this. Now I'm going to add about half a tablespoon at a time. I'm going to use a tablespoon of sage. and a tablespoon of black pepper. Okay. All right, we're gonna bring that to a boil and then we're gonna let it set and cool, let all those juices flow together and then I'll show you what's next. So I've had it boiling for a little while. I wanted to make sure that the juices were coming out of them, and it looks like that's happening. So our brine is boiling pretty good. I've stirred it two or three times. I set it off, and I'm going to cover it with this towel and just let everything sit and blend together for about an hour. Then after an hour. Okay, our brine is set for an hour. Actually, it only set for about 40 minutes. We, uh, put our ice cubes in it. We cooled it down to room temperature. We've emptied, we've got our turkeys ready and now we're just gonna put the turkeys in the brine. We're gonna fill the opening up with the brine so that it's soaking in it inside and out. Now 
Now I'm gonna get a plate and sit on that so that they're all the way covered and they're gonna sit like that overnight. So today we're gonna to show you how to get your turkey ready for the smoker. And this works whether you're smoking it, grilling it, you can actually smoke a turkey on a grill if you have a, a, a wood chip box and you can light that wood so that you get the smoke flavor. Uh, you can actually do this, soak it and put it in the oven. But we're, I just wanna say that this is the way I do things and I am always up for suggestions. If you do this differently or if you see some way to do it differently, I, I would encourage you to experiment. I would encourage you to try different things. Um, that's what I do. We're gonna use this applewood rub today. We really like this by Grill Mates. It really gives the the turkey just a, a apple spicy flavor. All right, let's fix some turkeys. This is not too difficult. I'm gonna cut the extra skin off. Kind of pick some of the, there's some onion stuck on here. And that turkey's ready to go. I use these wire screens is I, I kind of use it for a prop that uh, that keeps the turkey sitting up but it also lets the smoke come through So we're gonna put this guy on. We're gonna come back and do his brother or his sister. And then we're gonna smoke these until the temperature is 165 inside the, the breast. <clears throat> it's gonna take about six hours and we'll show you. Okay, we're in the smoker and temperature was going up. There's our transmitter. I gotta get this closed. 